the number one in the world. Julianne Moore to say that celebrated. Stay connected to who I once was. Actor Julianne Moore moved home a few times during her childhood would be something of an understatement. Because of her father's active military career, the family would move 23 times before Moore left home. She was even born at Fort Bragg, in North Carolina. That we hate sex. It can be a natural, zesty enterprise. However, there are some people, it is called satyriasis in men, nymphomania in women, who engage in it compulsively and without joy. Because she never had roots anywhere and couldn't form long-lasting relationships with any of her childhood friends, Moore describes herself as something of a loner as a child. Perhaps because of her difficult upbringing, Moore has displayed a superb ability to play troubled women during her professional career. She's capable of playing comedic roles, but seems to find more fulfillment in more serious acting parts in movies like Children of Men. No shade, only the coffee was spiked with ketamine. Oh, fuck off, you gotta be kidding. You know how many people I've tried I this with? Know. You'll be happy to know, out of the hundreds, hundreds. you are still the I'm only not doing one. It. Yes, you are. No, I'm not. Yes, you the are. car's moving yes, too much. Yes, you are. Mm -hmm. You are, right? <laughs> the kids are all right, and maps to the stars. Her crowning moment arrived in 2015, when she won the Best Actress Oscar for Still Alice, in which she played a woman suffering from early onset Alzheimer's disease. I read an article that said that winning an Oscar could lead to living five years longer. <laughs> if that's true, I'd really like to thank the Academy because my husband is younger than me.